News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants. Classes will resume as normal today over at Westlake High School after yesterday's lockdown and gun scare. Police got reports of a student with a gun, but thankfully no weapon was found and no one was hurt. The district says as a precaution, they will have extra security on campus. Police have arrested Juan Jesus Reyes in connection to a road rage incident. It happened in Progreso this past weekend. We're told Reyes admitted to the crime. A 16-year-old was stabbed. Reyes is being charged with aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. U.S. Senator John Cornyn will be in the Valley today. He'll be leading a group of Washington lawmakers on a tour of the border. The group will be doing a ride along with border officials. They're also going to be making a stop in McAllen at the Border Patrol Processing Facility. They're going to be talking to agents there. Then they'll be heading to the Anza Duas Park. They're hosting a press conference there shortly before 2 p.m. Channel 5 News will be there and we'll have more in our later newscast. A cold front made its way through the valley. We're waking up to much cooler temperatures, but we'll slowly warm up into the 80s by this afternoon. That's your News in 60. Have a great Friday. News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants.